Kylie Jenner, as of 2019, was tagged as the world's youngest self-made billionaire. Her cosmetics line was gold, and everyone wanted to get their hands on it. A few years down the line, things began changing, and her relationship with Timothy didn't make things better. In 2017, the brand's revenue was $68.7 million. Flash forward to 2023, and Kylie Cosmetics made less than half of this number. What exactly caused her downfall? Was her relationship with Timothy Chalamet really the cause, or was it something else? In 2023, during the Jean-Paul Gaultier fashion show, something sparked between Kylie and Timothy Chalamet, and not long after, it was rumored they were dating. Later, the couple was spotted kissing during Beyonce's performance at Inglewood's Sophie Stadium, confirming the rumors. While some agree this relationship might be as real as daylight and not just a public stunt, Timothy's fans do not agree, and were extremely disappointed as they believe Kylie is unworthy of their prince, Charming. Timothy's fandom has been extremely brutal, and massive amounts of hate has poured on poor Kylie. Fans have been attacking Kylie for being the wrong type of woman, saying she is too dumb and much lower in social status than Timothy. Does he hold her makeup brushes while she contours? Does she help him sift through Wes Anderson scripts? Does he give Stormy French lesson? And how did they end up together anyway? This is what the fans are saying. Kylie and Timothy made a public appearance at the Golden Globes, causing even more hate and backlash, not only from fans but from other celebrities as well. It was clear that Kylie felt extremely uncomfortable and out of place next to Hollywood's most talented actors, who gave her a side-eye and whispered behind her back. There has been speculation she's going broke as the house she put up for sale was slashed 50% in price. No rich mogul will do that. Not only that, Kylie Jenner's cost has gone down a spiral. Kylie launched Kylie Lip Kits in 2015, and due to Kylie's massive online followers and admitting to using lip liners, her brand skyrocketed. Collaborating with her family members added to the flames, and later on, Kylie Lip Kits began Kylie Cosmetics lines. In 2019, Kylie was named the world's youngest self-made billionaire, but not too long into the future, everything started to change. That same year, her sales were 62% less than those of 2016, and in 2022, it was worse as they had a 29% decrease in size. This wasn't the only problem, as controversies started to play out, like financial claims, revealing a lot of financial misrepresentation. But in 2020, she sold her line to Cody and has been trying to get it back since then. Now, what does that mean? Well, what this means is that the income she would get from her line will be slashed greatly. Since the tremendous decline in sales in 2022, customers have left and forgotten this brand for a lot of reasons. The first reason is this. When Kylie's beauty product first got to the market, it was advertised by her on her social media page since she had a massive following, and this makes great sense. Kylie used to be the it girl, and people were obsessed with her. They literally wanted her life, appearance, and especially her lips. So when she finally launched her products, everyone wanted their hands on them, and to top it all, they were scarce. If you don't know, the scarcity market is a great marketing strategy where the manufacturer of the product makes his or her product scarce to the customer, making a limited number of the products, causing the customers or consumers to retaliate by making them perceive the product or the commodity as of high value or worth, which in turn makes them buy these products from you. This was Kylie's strategy, and she sold out massively. But she sold her line to Cody, which is an American multinational beauty company that develops, markets, manufactures, and distributes cosmetics, fragrances, hair, skin, and nail care, and in this year only owns about 40 brands. Cody started making these products, and I'm referring to Kylie's cosmetics products, being more available to everyone, which ruined the entire gimmick, which boils down to the second reason, disappointment. After these products were made more available on the market, people started to notice that the prices of these beautiful products didn't match the quality, which made everyone tense and, of course, disappointed. With Kylie Jenner's company, Kylie Cosmetics, losing sales, she decided to branch out into other businesses, which is not a bad idea, but what she did next. In 2019, she launched Kylie Skin, a skincare line that was made to be affordable. You could get all six core products for $30 only. These six core products consist of foaming face wash, 
walnut face scrub, face moisturizer, vitamin C serum, vanilla milk toner, and eye cream. Other products included lip balm, broad spectrum SPF 30, sunscreen oil, and more. But something was wrong, and it was the walnut face scrub. Kylie Jenner got serious backlash with the ingredients used in manufacturing the walnut face scrub. As the name goes, the main ingredient should be walnuts, right? It was, as it turns out, walnut powder when used as an exfoliant is too harsh and irritating for the skin and even can cause allergies. In 2021, another business was launched, and it was called Kylie Baby. In 2024, she launched Sprinter, a vodka soda that came in four flavors, black cherry, peach, grapefruit, and lime. Fans were not happy about this because they felt she had no attachment to this new brand as she doesn't even drink vodka. Not long after, she launched Kai, a clothing line company partnered with her mother, Kris Jenner, controversies arose as people started noticing that her collections and designs were copied and the materials used for clothing were not up to standard. So what she's basically doing is venturing into all the businesses she can think of and finding the one that sticks. But most people have lost faith in her products. A huge factor which contributed to Kylie's downfall is her relationship with Hollywood's biggest talent, Timothy Chalamet. With this beautiful relationship came massive hatred from Timothy's fans because they think Kylie doesn't deserve such a handsome, intelligent, and talented man. Having 400 million Instagram followers and being wealthy and successful isn't enough. Her decline in revenue and popularity decreased even more when the public got to know they were dating. She has received tons of backlash, controversies, and unrest, all because she's in love with Timothy Chalamet. Kylie Jenner once held global influence and controlled the beauty world, but for a fact, she has fallen from grace and Timothy and Kylie being the unexpected couple brought more downfall. Can she get back up? Only time will tell. Do you think that Kylie and Timothy's relationship influenced her downfall? Comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Until next time.